The president signed the next stimulus bill that Congress passed on December 21. The legislation extends unemployment assistance not only for employees but also for independent contractors and other self-employed individuals for 11 weeks. The bill, H.R. 133, includes the Continued Assistance for Unemployed Workers Act of 2020, which provides for an extension of the CARES Act unemployment provisions from December 31, 2020 until March 14, 2021, including the provisions that had created a new form of benefits for all self-employed individuals, Pandemic Unemployment Assistance, PUA. As detailed in a prior blog post, the original CARES Act provided PUA benefits for up to $600 a week for as many as 39 weeks, retroactive to January 27, 2020. The new stimulus bill, CARES Act II, halves that amount and limits PUA to $300 per week. Those eligible for PUA also will receive an additional $300 per week through the end of the extension period, whereas CARES Act I had added $600 per week in federal stimulus payments. Finally, the new stimulus bill provides independent contractors with paid sick and paid family leave benefits through March 14, 2021. Independent contractors to apply for extended PUA benefits. It does not appear that independent contractors need to apply for additional PUA if currently receiving that benefit. Rather, it appears PUA2 benefits will simply be tacked on to PUAI benefits. However, for those independent contractors who have never received or are yet to receive PUA benefits, or if their 39 weeks of PUA have ended due to a retroactive commencement of benefits, it is expected that an application for PUA2 benefits will be required. CARES Act 2 contains a new provision unemployed or underemployed independent contractors who have an income mix from self-employment and wages paid by an employer are still eligible for PUA. Under CARES Act I, any such worker was typically eligible only for a state-issued benefit based on their wages. Under CARES Act II, though, the individual now is eligible for an additional weekly benefit of $100 if he-she earned at least $5,000 a year in self-employment income. The $100 weekly payment, which would be added to the $300 weekly benefit.